I guess I do have a question about like blurring. Um, like I know people. So yeah, would you recommend like blurring the whole face, blurring just the eyes, or just the mouth, or cropping? Um, or I can just kind of, cause like, I cropping is like most natural. Like there's not a, a weird blur, but then also blur is like normal to see in these types of photos. Um, but blur means that you get to see like the entire head as opposed to cropped. Um, I don't want to interrupt you. I'm just conscious of time because I have to go in three minutes for another call. So I'm just going to okay. answer your question quickly yeah. and then message me if there's anything else. You'll notice in the instructions okay. I've just sent you for the editing, I asked the photographer okay. to do three different versions of every photo. If your anonymity okay. isn't a, like if you're comfortable having a half blur, then it's better to have your whole photo in the whole face in the photo, not to crop it. And to have a full blur, if that's what you're comfortable with for anonymity, or a half blur to either show your mouth or your eyes in every photo. I asked the photographer to do both versions of every photo so that we can choose which one looks better per photo. And usually if you're smiling, we'll leave the smile. And then usually if your eyes look particularly seductive, then we'll leave the eyes exposed. And then you want to tell mm -hmm. Dean whatever level of blur you're comfortable with for your anonymity. So you can either have light, medium, or heavy. Obviously, the more mm -hmm. you can see of you, the better for the client. But only you can decide yeah. what you're comfortable with. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. If you want to learn more escorting tips, just click the link below this video.